So during my spring break, I wanted to go to the art museum and I hadn't been to this art museum since like I was a freshman or a sophomore in high school. So I was like, you know what, since um, I'm on spring break right now, let's just go. Yes, this content is from April, a really long time ago. <laughs> I don't know, lately I've just not have not been feeling confident in the way I look whatsoever. My skin is like going crazy. It goes like maybe like four or five days of really nice and then the rest of the month it's like terrible and I just really don't understand what's going on. I know it has something to do with my hormones. Regardless, it's just making me like super, super, super self-conscious. I don't really want to get in front of the camera and talk anymore. It's just really, really putting a damper on my self-confidence. I also have been struggling for the past like two and a half weeks with my mental health. I have been extremely depressed and it's kind of just the same stuff that I've been dealing with before. I feel like a failure. I feel hopeless. I literally have no idea what I'm doing right now. I, I don't know where my life is going at the moment and nothing seems to really be progressing in any sort of way and it's just very terrifying and just so much to take in at a time, you know? I don't know if that's even a great way to explain it, but I literally am just so tired of not being happy with my life and the way things are going. Everything just seems so stagnant and I just really, I honestly don't really know anymore. Right now, I'm just trying to focus on the good and the things I can't control because a lot of the stuff that's going on in my life, I simply cannot control.
I'm not. But that makes sense. I will say going to the museum helped me to just feel better about my life in general. It helped me to not feel as sad about things and just sad about my life and the way things are going. It, it was just, it's always really nice and therapeutic for me to just be surrounded by so much beautiful art all the time and to just experience other things that people create and people take the time to make to just feel the impact of someone else's art it's just beautiful and so therapeutic to me i think i'm gonna start going to more art museums or more art fairs just to be surrounded by art and other creatives and other people who appreciate art And earlier this month, we went to a cafe that's new to us. I don't know if it's actually new to the area, but it was such a vibe, y'all. I loved it so much. My friends said their drinks were amazing. I had already had my matcha for the day, so I didn't get matcha, but I got ube ice cream and Thai tea ice cream. They had really cool flavors, and ube is now my favorite ice cream flavor. Like, it is so freaking good. I love it so much. One of my friends was back in town from Japan and so we hung out with her and we just vibed out and hung out and talked about all kinds of random stuff for like four or five hours and it was such a good time and you know i just really cherish these moments with friends because it just reminds you that life is actually worth living again life is actually worth the struggle besides hanging out with your family um it's just really nice to be around surrounded by people who actually love you it was just a good time all around and i do want to come back and try their matcha Ugh, they are a little far out for me, but for good matcha and ice cream, I will travel. So, yeah, I will have to be coming back here soon. If you are in the area, I highly recommend this cafe.